Hey y'all, gonna run through a quick update on what I have been doing um, with my Steampunk Blues project. This is my guest design team project for Sunflowers and Doors. I added some charms here and some chain. And then I got some eyelets put in. I've done some beading. Here I beaded these strings. So now when I put these notebooks in, if I get this notebook in here, and I tie this closed, there is now enough tension to hold the notebooks in. Now I just pulled on these little strings down here and to be honest with you I have not tied those little strings off yet because I know I have to do it with tweezers um, because I didn't plan ahead for this part of the project and so now I have to fight a little bit to get those tied but I'm okay with that for now I can just pull on them and it will tighten up. And here you can see where I weaved the string through this chain, added some beads, and I'm going to tie it off to that brad. On this page, I um, have decided that I need something going on down here on the bottom to keep this journal tag from being so flippy floppy. I'm falling out of the book and then I added some eyelets to these tags so I will be coming up with something on the bottom of that page I know you can see some beading going on I'll explain that on this side of the book I'm starting to add charms worked on the same beading to hold the notebooks in added some eyelets to some more things on this side of the book Let's see that holds it in there pretty good. Once I get it tied off, it'll hold it well. Like I said, I'll be adding something to the bottom of here. Now I'm going to explain these beads. These beads I put on stretch gold string. And I just tied them in a knot. And the reason why I left the strings unclipped is while I'm working on the book and I'm moving it around, it's going to stretch and stretch. And it's going to set these knots. Um, and then once I feel like they're set well, I'll clip the strings. And the strings that are left, I'll take this larger bead and just slide it over the top of the knot to hide it. So you can see here, you can't see where that's tied. And here's where I, I tied this one. Now here's the other thing. These look really big, right? And these look really small. And let me show you why. Because when you close this book up, here's what it looks like. If you start adding things in here and journaling in here and collecting things in here, you're going to want some room... For these panels to expand right so you're not going to want these closures closures you're not going to want these beaded strings to be super tight you're going to want to have room so that this book can grow and get bigger and thicker and fuller of course that is based on personal preference so that's what i've got for today guys thanks for watching y'all